Hello guys, today I am going to show you how to install Windows 11 on your computer. And if you are new to my channel, please consider subscribe and like on this video. Without wasting time, let's get started. First, you need to download Windows 11 ISO file from the internet. To do that, go to your browser. You can use any browser for this one. I like to use uh, Firefox. Then search for Windows 11. Yes, so and hit enter. You can see the first option that is the uh, Microsoft website. Just tap on it. Okay, now you are in Microsoft Windows 11 download section. Now you need to scroll down a little bit. Okay, in the bottom side, you can see download Windows 11 disk image for x64 devices. And you can select the drop down from here and just tap on download then it will be download on your computer it is around like uh, 5 gigabytes so I have already download that one so I am not, not going to do that again after downloading you need to insert the pen drive to make bootable that one I'm going to open this PC these are my hard drives. Now I am going to insert the pen drive. Alright, it is added here. It is, you can see, it's around 15 gigabytes. Now what you have to do is, you need to again go to your browser. And search for Rufus, R-U-F-U-S and hit enter. This is the one we need to uh, make a bootable pen drive. Just tap on it and go to bottom side, and you can see there is option called Rufus 4.6 to standard version. Just tap on it. It is around 1.4 megabytes, but I only download that one, so I'm I'm not going to do that. Just minimize this one. Go to downloads folder. You can see it is already download. Then after what you need to do is double tap on it and hit uh, tap on yes. And I, I'm not going to check the update so select no. Alright. Now you can see it is automatically identified my pen drive. This is my pen drive name. And then after if it is not identified you can click on this drop down menu and select your pen drive. And if you have multiple pen drive, you can choose the which which one you need for this. Then after tap on the select button, it asks where is your ISO file located. So in my case, it is on uh, E drive software, and this is the file I need to uh, bootable Windows 11 English International X64. Select this one and tap on op open. Now you need to, uh, do, you don't need to change this one, but you need to change this one, partition scheme. You can see there are two options here, GPT and MBR. Bef uh, before install the, your system, you need to find which hard drive partition is your computer have. To find that one, in Windows 11, you can just right click on this start menu. And in, the, in this menu, you need to go to disk management. Windows 10 also same. Now, uh, there are two hard drives here. Uh, I am going to install the operating system to this hard drive. So, just right click on it and tap on properties. And in this menu, tap on volumes. You can see partition style is guided partition table. That means GPT. So, close this one, close this one. And I keep this as GPT. Okay. Don't need to this uh, one change. And... You can change the name of the volume label. I don't need to do that. And you can change the file system, but NTFS is better. Then after you need to tap on start. It will ask some uh, requirement uh, changes because you know T uh, TPM 2.0 below versions can't install Windows 11. But you can avoid that uh, thing using this one. Okay. Uh, you can. Uh, if you add the tick mark here you can avoid that uh, requirements and you can 
uh, create local username using this name you can change this one and set the regional options as the users and disable data collection disable beat local you can tick or untick this as your uh, customization opinion so then after tap on ok and it will be start to uh, yeah you need to tap on ok because it will say all the data on device will be erased it is ok so tap on ok now it will take around 10 or 5 to 10 minutes then after your pen drive will be make completely bootable then after uh, do that you have to install the windows using uh, you need to restart your computer and uh, go to boot menu and select the pen drive as a bootable device then after the process is uh, similar to windows 10 installation also so i have i haven't any device to record this one so you can find that using another video or something so this is how you can make a bootable uh, pen drive for install the windows thank you for watching